guys, what's up? I'm your host Atra and welcome to the 19th episode of The Week in Music exclusively on indicomusic.com. If we could slow time down, it would definitely be for this week because there was so much to take in and so little time. Let's just start on a positive and a light note. On our indie playlist, we featured Pratik Kuhar because he almost made most of us cry the moment he released Kasoor. Not only did his vocals take you on an overwhelmed ride, but also the video made you answer the questions he was asking in the visuals. The video features some of the most honest and beautiful reactions to a set of questions that Kuhar himself emailed to his fans. There is a funky enemy. In another news, Kanye West is running for the President of the United States. Yes, you heard it right. We almost had to hold on to our seats when we heard this. Just when we thought 2020 couldn't surprise us anymore, Kanye made this announcement. Previously to this, Kanye West had shared a picture with Elon Musk, making them the coolest bros in the town. So it's no surprise that he supports this decision. Want to know more about this? Head to indigomusic.com and catch the latest happenings in the world of music. Lastly, Charlie Puth has spoken and this time spoken with confidence. He took to his social media to share his thoughts regarding the toxicity of stand culture between BTS and the army. The concern rose when someone sent Charlie a nasty message saying that he used BTS for his fame. The accusations speak about how the singer is trying to piggyback of the group's popularity for his own gain. Well, that's pretty rough. Well, that's all from me for today. I'll be back with more news the next week as the sagas worldwide unfold. So stick around on indigomusic.com and tune in to The Week in Music. This is Atara signing out and keeping it real.